Hello everybody and welcome back. This is the doctor and we are on the um, Zindi Contortrix and it's time to do Infected Space Elites. Now I am using the Omega set, the uh, Mark 12 Omega set and the phased biomatter weapons and I will use the special ability which is the weapon platform when it's appropriate. I think I'm gonna wait until uh, near the end when you have to take down the gate and then the tack cube at the end here nice and I believe that will be the best time to use the platform otherwise I have to wait too long for the cooldown and the whole thing will probably be over by then. Moving on. Cube, you've had your last day. You will be Now right here it's going to get tricky because I've got the gate attacking me, trying to drain my shields and stuff. And on this ship, it can um, actually damage me quite a bit. Why won't you select? Come on. It's not targeting that correctly. We are aboard. Surrender your vessel and prepare for us. Oh, there we go. We got out of that. Just have to be careful around that gate with this ship. It can take it down really fast. Get these first. Target shield have failed. Target shield have failed. Four shields failing. All right, now that we're doing the gate, let's take bring out our. Uh, our um, 
platform there. It's actually attacking spears over there, I think. No, it's attacking the gate. I see it. Yeah, it's attacking the gate. Oh crap, what hit me? I didn't even see that. I was doing well and then all of a sudden I'm dead. Well that ain't good, see what I mean? But that can happen on a cruiser too. Ooh, oh well. I blew up once. Oh well, it has to happen every now and then I guess. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to go heal though, I took some damage there. Wow, all right. Infected space elite with this ship. Very fast, very powerful. Love it. I need to go uh, beam down here and heal my damage, though. Before the next one, or else. The shuttle to Saturn will leave at 0830 hours. Da -da 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 -da. I'm jumpy, I'm jumpy, I'm jumpy, I'm jumpy. Repair. Yippee. All right, that's all good. Cool. All right. Well, I'm going to get queued up for CSE and I will be right back. Hello everybody and welcome back. We are going to do CSE now. And uh, normally I don't do the Kang because I need to show you the other abilities of the ships on these things. But I want to do the Kang now with this ship to show you guys, you know, how a powerful ship, how well a powerful ship can uh, do the Kang and do something like that. And really help out your teammates if you have a ship like this. So I'm going to do the Kang. I'm going to protect it. And I'm going to show you how well this works on a powerful ship. At least I hope so. Hey, I got King. So there's somebody who has no idea what they're doing. That's great. Now, oh, this thing's still on cooldown. I was going to bring it out and show you how that will help uh, doing the Kang here, but darn it, it's still on cooldown. Oh, well. But as you can see, no problem in a ship like this protecting the Kang. So there's a noob who has no idea what they're doing. That's just awesome. It was even stated in the chat before starting RML, right middle left. And there goes Tarkin doing the middle while everybody's doing. What an idiot. Oh well, I'm still gonna protect the Kang, do my job. We'll bring out the little thingy here. Now we can uh, use it. There we go. See, it's attacking my foe. Very nice. Now we'll go over here and do this side. 
Uh, they're coming over there, so they'll help me with those ships. Warning. Ship is under attack. Target the shield. Go. Good. Everything's good. All right. Now my think. I think my platform is already dissipated. See, it's a shame. It only lasts one minute. Then you have to wait. Three minute cooldown. So, yeah, uh, here's a little um, PSA. If you're going to join a public elite channel, learn the tactics, do them right, know what they are, don't be a noob. <laughs> I mean, you can be a noob if you're new, but. Seriously, learn what you're supposed to do. I mean, if you're in an elite channel, be elite. <laughs> know the tactics. Know what to do. Target shield. Now I could use my platform. Good. This is where it gets real challenging. I'm having to heal a lot because I'm I can I can blow up very easy here. Like like that, for example. <laughs> I was being held by tractor beam. Couldn't go anywhere. I don't have polarized hull. And uh, there you go. That happens. But. We almost got this. In fact, that thing's about to blow, I think. Yeah. So I'm going to go over here and contact Kang. That'll uh, make sure we get the optional. Done, done, done. Now we can go help. And uh, that's that. So even though one team mem member um, didn't know what to do or wasn't even listening, don't you love that when you try to tell them what to do and they don't even listen or comment back at you? We still succeeded.
Okay, there you go, everybody. The Contortrix in CSE. And again, I will leave with this message. If you're in an elite... Uh, hold on. Uh, my thing's not working. There we go. Okay. If you are in an elite STF channel or even the public STF channel, if it's an elite channel, Know the tactics, know what RML means, know what that means when people say right, middle, left, and then do it. Don't go off and do your own thing, please. That just makes it bad for everybody. Can you imagine how bad it's going to be when um, Delta Rising comes out and they raise the heart, the uh, how hard all this stuff's going to be? Elite's going to be even more terrible. And if people don't listen, if you don't know the tactics and you don't listen and learn how to do them correctly and just do your own thing, your team is going to fail the new elite STFs. It's just a thing that's going to happen. So guys, listen to your teammates. All right, let me get set up for case. All right, hello everybody. It is the doctor again and ready for our case run. Get him record space elite in the Concordrix. I have requested left probes again, and normally I don't do this in the runs, but I want to show you again how um, a good ship does that. Uh, another way you can help your team, if you you know watch do the probes and all that, having my powerful cannons and all that I have on this ship, plus my um, weapon platform, absolutely no problem watching probes. So um, this will be something different to watch, something new. Not even in weapons range, huh? Here I'm trying to fire. There we go. Our weapon platform is ready. That's awesome. Your defensive capabilities are unable to withstand us. Lower your shields and await assimilation. I'm trying not to use my abilities. I don't want them to be cooled down because I want to go use them right now. my weapon that's my weapon platform firing for me very nice so that just does the job very well Rear shields failing. stupid gates that gate you got to stay out of the range of that gate because uh huh, there goes my weapon platform firing on the gate which i don't really want it to do Now, while I'm waiting for uh, spawns here, I can go ahead and help by taking down some generators. There's something that just came through. Fire anytime now. There you go. <laughs> now my thing has already gone away. I have to wait for the cooldown again on it. Now, if I was in a little bit of a more tanky sh escorty ship, I would take out this other generator, but that'll spawn the cube. And um, if I was in the Nakor, I could probably do it better because I could take it. In this ship, I might blow up. <laughs> trying to take on the cube plus the gate firing on me and trying to watch the um, probes. Uh, but if you're in the right ship, you can actually do all three. 
Warning. You the ship is under attack. Borg. They've already got both their cubes down over there. Ship is under attack. Target shield has failed. Now when the cube pops here, I will help with it. My uh, platform is almost ready. I'll definitely use that. Saving my cannon rapid fire for the probes. Target shields have failed. Okay, they. Oh, I thought they. I thought they had their gate down. I was thought. Oh no, I'm about to be swarmed. Over here, I'm giving them a little help. You will be assimilated. Okay, uh, there we go. Ta da. Okay, they got their gate down. <laughs> There we go. All right. There we go. That was a little bit of uh, a uh, different thing there for you guys. Don't normally do the probes, but now I have. Warning, ship is under attack. Crap. 
crap. She's going, I'm going to be within her firing range when she appears. Watch this. Nope. Yep. Yeah, see? And I can't get away because my evasive maneuvers is out. So I'm about to blow up right now. It's just all there is to that. Oh, maybe I can get out of the way. Yeah, I got out of the way. Oh, there we go. She didn't get a chance to cloak the second time. All right, everybody. That is the Zendi Contortrix and all the elite SDFs. As you can see, not terribly bad at all. Very powerful ship if you build it right, of course. It has a lot of potential. And I think a lot of people would have fun with this ship. It's a very powerful ship. It's a little more glassy than the Nakor, like I said. But, still a powerful ship. I still prefer the Nakor over this one, though. If I were going to fly one long term, I would go for the Nakor. Alright, well this is not the last. I will go ahead and do an Undine Battle Zone run with this as well. And I'll go ahead and put on the Counter Command stuff. And uh, go with that for that run. And uh, then that way you can at least see it with two different kind of gear sets on there. Okay, well, thank you for watching, and stay tuned for the next one.